Okay, day 53. And we're getting into cycling shoes. The differences between road shoes, mountain bike shoes, and general SPDs and how you click in, click out kind of thing. So, if you like this video, please leave a comment down below. If you didn't like this video, leave a comment anyways. And hey, don't forget to click subscribe, the notifications next to it with a little bell, ding! And have a great day. Hey, I'm Bill from the Truck Bicycle Store. I'm going to talk to you now about cycling shoes and cycling pedals. So, why do we wear cycling shoes and cycling pedals? Uh, not just to make it awkward to walk around coffee shops. They're actually much more efficient on the bike. So when you clip into a pedal, it enables you to do a full pedal revolution. So you're maximizing more of your pedal stroke. Most of your, your pedal stroke comes from that push down, but this helps you in the pull up as well. So there's two different styles of, of shoe and pedal combos out there. So you have more of a mountain style. Also people use this for commuting and touring. Uh, lots of different variations of this style, but how it works is basically the cleat recesses up inside the tread, so when you're walking, you're not actually walking on the cleat. So the, it uses a smaller cleat, here it is here, and the cleat just bolts into the bottom of the shoe and sits so that it's not going to uh, touch as you're walking. Um, so nice thing in mountain biking as you're scaling around rocks and that, uh, easier to walk and then also if you're you're doing a tour and you're going to do a little bit of uh, sightseeing You can walk around in a cycling shoe that isn't uh, clopping around uh, The pedal that works with this shoe is this guy here So this is dual sided so you can clip into either side makes it a little bit easier when you're starting out and learning so dual sided Don't have to kick the pedal over to get into it so that's your typical mountain touring kind of commuting style. This here is a road pedal, okay? The difference here, larger surface area. So what this is going to do, this is going to give you a better power transfer. It's also going to disperse the pressure over your foot better, so it won't fatigue your foot. The other nice thing is it's a real tight interface, so you don't get any lateral play, so it's easier on your knees. All the cleats have a degree of float in them, so your heel can float. Um, what that does is it just makes it easier on your knees. You can get different amounts of float with different pedals and different cleats, so that is available, just know that, okay? This is what the cleat looks like. So the cleat just sits down into the pedal like so. What you see, you're walking around on this, which is not quite as convenient as that other tread that we saw. The other thing with a road pedal is it's single sided so you can only clip into the one side. So you got to kick the pedal over and step into it. Once you're clipped in and going this is way better. It's so much more efficient and such a better interface that it's much much nicer to do the long distances on. Not quite as convenient though. So with the road shoe, uh, different styles out there. You can see this is a super fancy one opposed to a more basic. So what makes a road shoe better and a mountain shoe for that matter is the road shoe is much lighter, okay? The better shoe is much li lighter, uh, the less expensive one heavier. Uh, it's also got a stiffer sole. So again, what a stiffer sole does, it just disperses the pressure better over your foot, so it will give you a better power trans transfer and give you less of a hot spot. Um, the other thing that the industry is going to now is a BOA system. So a BOA system is a dial closure. So the fancier ones you can do a, a both ways, so you can loosen it or tighten it as you go. I use the, the, the dual direction all the time as a riding. So as your feet are swelling or you're getting into a more aggressive situation, you can tighten the shoe up or you can loosen it off a bit. Um, the less expensive style will still use a ratchet system, that just is a ratchet closer and Velcro. Still great, not quite as stiff, a bit heavier. Um, road shoes can get up there in price, this one's pretty fancy. This maybe what I should get. I don't know. <laughs>